we are going to reset New York's priorities on January 1. Children and adults with disabilities, seniors without savings, classroom funding and special education, opioid addiction, safe drinking water, signal switches and subway tunnels, those are the kinds of things that will move New York forward. Get that, listen clear, those are the kinds of things that will get New York moving forward. And what's out? Cuomo's multi-billion dollar pay for play giveaways, gone yesterday. Corporate welfare, gone yesterday. We're going to make New York attractive to all businesses. Wasteful, duplicative, redundant, overlapping agencies, gone yesterday. Budget-busting Medi budget Medicaid payments from counties that can't afford it, gone yesterday. New York will finally take responsibility and improve the way we help those in need while achieving savings. That alone saves $2 billion a year. Medicaid fraud, gone yesterday. Unless, unless you want to lose your medical license and go to jail. Backdoor borrowing and garbage accounting that hides our true debt, gone yesterday. It's dishonest and it's dangerous and it's stealing from our children. Now, ladies and gentlemen, you might know this, but one of my very first jobs was mucking horse stalls in Tivoli as a kid. I can tell you that that might prepare me well for my journey to Albany. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to go to Albany and do a little mucking together, all of us. And to accomplish this, we're going to empower New Yorkers, advocates, and stakeholders. We're going to embrace every good idea and welcome anyone honestly and earnestly willing to bring about the change we need. We'll recruit the best and brightest from our colleges and businesses to audit, audit this broken state government. And we will reform this state re government, and, government and together revitalize New York. What we have now is an outmoded, outdated, and antiquated 20th century government at its worst. Together, we will move New York, pushing, screaming, into the 21st century. Start by zero-based budgeting from day one. No agency gets a dime until it can show we're getting what we pay for. If If an agency is just pushing around papers, it's a former agency. If a commission hasn't met and is merely occupying space, I'm shutting it down. And if it's an agency that's working well, a task force meeting its goals or a program achieving its outcomes, we'll emulate it. We're going together to tap into the ingenuity of state workers and the genius of Silicon Alley and our upstate tech communities to streamline service delivery for those in need making services less expensive and more effective. We're going to do it systematically in every department, in every agency of state government. And I'm here today to announce, I am here today to announce that yesterday is over. Tomorrow is approaching. It's coming because it has to. We've reached our breaking point. We've got to get smart. We have to be compassionate. And we must put the New Yorkers paying the bills first.